So for all you Harry Potter fans out there like me, this recipe is as real as it gets for Otter's Fizzy Orange Juice Drink from Hogsmeade at the Three Broomsticks. Starting off, we're going to slice up some mandarin oranges and regular oranges. That's going to be three mandarins and two regular oranges. The last orange that I'm going to slice here is going to be a slice for the rim of the glass. Next, we're going to slice a half of a lemon. We only want to squeeze half of that. Don't want too much tartness in this. It's really important to use as many fresh ingredients as possible because we don't want an artificial taste. We want to have that natural orange citrusy flavor. Okay, so after we bring all of that together, we're going to start working on mixing some of our other ingredients. First, we're going to add our vanilla. We don't want to get too carried away with this. We just want a little bit, just enough for the flavor. Here I'm adding slightly less than a quarter of a teaspoon, just sprinkling that in there, kind of eyeballing it. Next, we're going to add one full teaspoon of honey. Give that a stir. This next part is completely optional. I just happen to have some tangerine popsicles made from real fruit in the freezer that my kids didn't care for, so I decided why not add that. It's called Otter's Fizzy Orange Juice for a reason, so now we need to add the fizzy aspect to this drink. First up is going to be a cream soda of your choice. Go ahead and add the whole can to that mixture. Next, we need to add an orange fizzy soda. Get that all mixed up, but try not to shake it up too much because we don't want to lose that fizz. Now we need to make our mixture for the rim of the glass. Now this may seem like a step that you're thinking about skipping because it's fancy or maybe not necessary in your eyes, but I do recommend do not skip this step because it adds a whole nother level of flavor when you drink the drink. The goal here is just to wet the rim of the glass with some of our leftover juice we had from earlier and then to coat the rim with our cinnamon sugar mixture that we made. Go ahead and pour that into your glass that you prepared. We are almost done but not quite yet. We have one more very important step. And the last but certainly not least step in this process is to make your whipped topping. Now if you remember from the movies, it was common to see a frothy whipped topping on the drinks in the three broomsticks. So that's the look I was going for here. Plus if you like a creamsicle, then this is the way to go to get that creaminess. You do not have to have a frother for this. You can use a blender as well to achieve the same result. What I'm shooting for here is to fill at least the remaining gap in the glass, hopefully more. Sprinkle a little bit more of that cinnamon sugar mixture on top for an added zhuzh. Then we'll cut a little slit in our orange and stick that on the side of the glass. And guys, I'm being 100% honest with you when I say that this is probably the best drink that I've ever had. I even texted my friends after I made this and told them the same thing. If you want to go the adult beverage route, you could add some of this to it. I didn't have any on hand, which was fine because I got to share this with my kids and they were all so crazy about it. Last little tip, stick a straw in it, mix up that froth, and it tastes just like a creamsicle. You gotta try this out, you won't regret it.